So here we are, we're in Sri Lanka, we're in our uh, manufacturer, and we're gonna see the process of how our boxer briefs are made from the moment the fabric comes in to the moment that the boxer brief is a finished good. So this is all of our fabric. Once the fabric passes an inspection and it's approved, ready to go into production, it comes over here. The fabric is currently relaxing. It's chilling out. We also keep track of when the fabric was first brought here so we could monitor how long it's been relaxing and make sure it hits 24 hours. Next, we get to this machine. This is called a spreader. And what it does is it takes a fabric that's relaxed and spreads it across the whole table so that they could get ready for cutting. All the parts are cut separately. The band, the pouch, the back, and the gusset. And they're later combined to make the boxer brief. All the trims are brought here into these buckets. We have the different cut fabrics. We got even our thread over here. And we have our elastic band. What you see behind us is the assembly line for our product. There's 26 different machines that go into making our boxer brief and 32 different operators that are used in the whole process. And the whole thing is followed by RFID codes, like that we could keep track of every single step of the process. First step of the manufacturing process for our boxer brief is the elastic band. And that's where it starts over here, where it gets cut to size and burnt on the edges so that it doesn't fray and it doesn't spread. Next, the elastic band comes to this machine where it's stitched together depending on the different size at different spots. After the elastic band, the next part that we're gonna produce is the pouch. The pouch and the gusset are both produced at the same time. It takes eight machines to make the pouch alone. This pouch over here, eight machines. We finally get a finished pouch that's ready to go on the garment. So what's happening here is that she's gonna attach the pouch to the front body of the boxer brief. So now we get to the mission critical stage of the production process. And it's all of these orange tags that you see. This is where the elastic band is finally attached to the boxer brief. There's a marker on the garment that shows them where the center point is. And there's a particular way that the fabric is sewn so that it doesn't curl and the stitch goes on perfectly. And that's where all of this happens. There's a quality control officer that passes every two hours to see how many pieces are defective. If there's one, the sticker comes yellow. If there's two or more, it's red. And if everything is perfect, then we're green. In this station, the garments are flipped inside out so that all the stitches and seams on the inside could be checked. And then it comes to this station where the garment is pressed and it's getting ready to be folded. Once the products are fully checked, folded and pressed and placed in their garment bags, this is what they look like. It always has to pass through a metal detector just to make sure that everything is good and there's no pieces of the needles that are still stuck in it. And these are some boxes that are ready to go. And it's nice to see them because we're so used to seeing them in our warehouse and in our office in Canada. But here we finally get to see them where they're produced in Sri Lanka. And that's how you make a man-made boxer brief.